What is going on, ladies and gentlemen of the internet? It's your boy Tom Origins here, as per usual. I screwed up. See this mouth? It's a big mouth and it talks too damn much. I was really, 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 really big, fat, juicy pleb. And I thought that there'd be no chance in heaven or hell that I'd ever hit. 10,000 channel views. So I'm like, hey, I'm going to Benidorm. I had a friend who went to Benidorm. She got a tattoo done. I thought maybe I should go Benidorm and get a tattoo done. And my big stupid mouth got me in trouble. Pretty much, I thought I'd never hit 10k. Ever. I remember when I started this channel. And there was like five of you who were supportive. And the rest of the people were absolute... Terrors. Internet terrors. I've had roasts. I've had hate. I've had it all. And to be honest, I thought the odds were stacked against me. I underestimated my community. And for that, I apologise deeply. I'm very sorry that I underestimated you amazing people. And I underestimated the support you can apply when we work together as a community. I underestimated you. And I apologise that deeply. I didn't get the tattoo. I'm 16 years of age. If I was to get a tattoo, I'd still have it when I'm like 70, when I'm 80, when I'm 90, when I'm dead. I'd still have it. Because tattoos are supposed to be important and they're supposed to be meaningful. I'm on 400 YouTube subscribers. I can't drop out a sixth form. Fingers crossed if I'm lucky enough to get in. I can't drop out a sixth form on 400 subscribers and become a YouTube multi-gazillionaire like some people did with college and university. I am not in that position yet. When I am, if I am, if I am God blessed enough to get to that stage of YouTube, then talk to me about tattoos. PewDiePie himself, biggest guy on the internet, he ain't gone and got a tattoo. They're permanent and they can stay on your body forever and they would stay on your body forever unless you get them surgically removed. I want my first ever, ever tattoo to be something really well thought about, not something rapidly rushed into when I'm 16 years of age. And I shouldn't have opened my big fat mouth and started blabbing off as if I'd never hit 10k. I was gobsmacked when I hit 10k. It happened whilst I was on a family holiday. Benadorm was a family holiday. I filmed it and did it as a YouTube series. A bunch of weird technical crap happened over on the internet with my YouTube channel and with a bunch of other smaller YouTube channels because people were messaging me about it. But... I've managed to somehow come back, video views have gone down, and people have unsubscribed. I think they were like ghost accounts or something. Something really retarded or weird happened on the internet, on my YouTube and with some other people's. But I'm just glad mine's kind of straightened out right now, and we are on 400 odd views. And tomorrow when I do a Tom Talks episode, or technically today because it's kind of 1 o'clock in the morning, and I couldn't go to bed without making this video because I felt deeply saddened by it. I really wish I would have got a tattoo. In my head right now, I'm probably thinking, yeah, I would have loved to get a tattoo. But five years down the line, ten years down the line, would I have regretted it? I don't know. So I'm really sorry for opening my fat mouth. But as a punishment for myself, which I think is only right, you, the community, who has worked so hard to get me to where I am, I couldn't do this channel without a community like this one. I wouldn't be... Gr I wouldn't be on YouTube if I didn't have a community like this one. I've underestimated you and I deeply, deeply, deeply apologise for underestimating you and, and all your amazing abilities. So, I recommend we do this. Because I was a big, massive screw-up by blabbing about this tattoo and not getting one, maybe I should do... No, definitely. Definitely I should do a punishment, a forfeit, if you will. And I think we should do this. Say if I'm going to do a regular upload thing where I'm going to be like, yes, I'm going to upload every single day for the next X amount of days. If I don't stick to that schedule, I think as a community, we should pick a punishment for me to do. Now, down in the comment section of this video, on the social media that I link down below, I want you to come up with a fun, entertaining to watch, easily set up and done challenge. You've got loads. You've got the chili challenges. You've got the, like, um, I think, like, the water balloon condom challenge thing. You've got the... What's the thing called now? Um, 
I can't remember. The cinnamon. The cinnamon challenge. You've got loads of them challenges that we could do. A while ago, I did upload a challenge video, and that got quite a lot of views. And it, I, I can't speak. I've got jet lag a little bit. I'm very tired. Um, I actually got a lot of good responses from that. A lot of people laughing. A lot of people liking. And I think that's what I I need to do from now on. So whenever I promise the community something and I don't fully commit to this, I have to do a challenge or a forfeit submitted by you, the community. So tonight, tomorrow night, whenever you're free, grab some friends, grab the internet, get your device, have a look for some easy to do set up challenges. I might pick like three, maybe three, maybe two, depends how harsh you go. I'll pick a, a decent... Three or two, we'll see. Three or two entertaining challenges. And then I can see which ones I can, like, obviously do, are affordable, and are going to be entertaining to watch. I'm sorry, I let you down. I feel very bad about that, and I wish I could make it up to you. Hopefully on this mystery trip, for two weeks, when I let that drop tomorrow in the Tom Talks, or today, sorry, in the Tom Talks episode, you can forgive me, and we can go back to being friends. I'm very sorry. I love you all very much. Thank you for the 400 subscribers, and I will thank you properly tomorrow when I've gone to sleep and I wake up and I'm I'm a lot more fresh. <laughs> and I do apologise deeply. You mean the world to me. Keep, keep subscribing, keep liking, keep watching for these vlogs, because I love doing them, and I hope you love watching them. If you do, slap the thumbs up button, subscribe, share it with your friends, and I'll see you in tomorrow's episode. Stick around. Peace.